<sighs> Take them leave 57! Take them leave 57! <sighs> Take them leave 57! Yeah! 57! 57! 57! Think film leave 57! Mm -hmm. Selects, and you can find me at selects.me and um, 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 and the videos. Share them and get them all out there, you know, because there's a lot of people out there that could use this information. You know, before I sat down and did this video, I thought, you know, there's there's so much people could do to transform their lives with this stuff because, I mean, I have, I have, I'm a human being, you're a human being. I mean, there's, you know, there's so many, like, there's a video out there that talks about manifesting and everything like that. And, um, you know, they just kind of brush over everything. And then they have these people that go on there and say, yes, and I remodeled my $2 million home because it was, you know, we need to be where we're at right now. We're right, right now. We're in the trenches, say. Uh -huh, we're in the trenches, because that's where you got to start. You got to start in the trenches. You got to start in the beginning. I mean, in the beginning. In the beginning, for people, is the, the basic thing that this can happen in, in your know, life. And you know, you know, the commonality, uh, the common thread, the common thread, the common thread about most people out there is that, you know, there we're, we live in a negative society. We live, 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 we live in a negative culture. Um, uh, people uh, are pretty, you know, there's, isn't it pathetic to think, I mean, it just kind of popped into my head that there are more, there is more, <coughs> well, it's obvious, it's obvious there's negativity, but there are more haters out there in this world than there are lovers. Think about that. I mean, you know, is that a fair statement to say that are, there's, there are people out there that are promoting, there are more people out there in this world that are that are that are diving into and delving into more negativity and thinking negative and being negative and trying to bring down than there is any positive out there in this world so you know here's the saying here's the saying is you know you you can't you cannot control the external circumstances of the things that are happening the best thing that you're going to do is be able to work on you, work on you, work on you. And if you can start with you, <coughs> excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. And then, if you know, if the many people that are out there that are watching these videos, you know, individually, you know, if you're all, if you're all out there, you're all out there, all out there working on yourselves and trying to take your seven, a, take yourself in a different direction, you know, because there's that thing out there. If you think positive thoughts, positive things will happen. Well. Yes, by and large, that's true. But to sit there and go, try to force it. You know, try, I'm going to force, I'm going to force all this. I'm going to force thinking of negativity and I'm going to, or I'm going to force positivity and I'm not going to, and I'm always going to think positive thoughts. You know, and how's that last? How long does that last? A day or two or three before you're back to your old self again? Um, you know, that's kind of like, it's kind of like, kind of like, kind of like diets. You know, they work. We're real disciplined with them. We lose the weight. And then what happens to it? I mean, you know, what they say, like, what's her name? Mama June admits she's over 200 pounds I saw the other day and you know what did she do you know she went through all this kind of stuff but she never really made the changes inside so that she can make it lasting and this is what this is what I want to do I want to do with you and you and you and you and you and you, and you. cuz this is why this is why this is why this is why and it's it's got to start you got to start in the trenches. You got to start in the trenches. You got to start where it's difficult. You know, because if you can walk yourself out of the trenches, oh, well, it's difficult. And then at first it's been difficult for a while. And then you've been, then you've been, then you've been, you've been working, 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 working on yourself. And, and, on, and, and, and you're trying to push, 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 push it, the more positive, you know, because oh, if I think positive thoughts, positive things will happen. No. It's a lot more complex than that. Because you as a human being, you, you as a human being, you're a lot more complex than, you know, than meets the eye. <laughs> yeah. We are connected in so many different facets as human beings and as a species on this planet. We are connected with so many 
different facets that you can't just do one thing and think that you're going to create change. It's got to be a consistent and disciplined persistency. And I think if you can start in the beginning with, um, you know, you're paying, paying attention to your thought life and what your narrative is and where you're driving yourself on a condition on a continual basis, then that's the, that, that trenches, that's pain in the trenches, you know, starting in the, in the beginning, you know, when you're you're kind of just taking a look at your own life. <laughs> and when you can begin to change your life with those kinds of things, you know, like I told you, talk about the, when the friend I had that said, you know, happens. You know what I'm saying? Happens, you know, and you, you can stop some of those things, you know, because the story I told about that guy, he's being consistent with that all the time. Something that came out of his mouth all the time. And then what was happening? Uh-huh. Uh huh. Seriously, seriously. I mean, <coughs> crashing by design, you know, just because of the thoughts that cross your mind and the consistent persistency of the, those things that are happening. So you've got to create the change here and dig yourself out of the negative to begin with. And, you know, maybe you're a person out there that, well, hmm, hmm, I just really don't hmm, seem to have any of those things, you know. No, everybody does one way or the other. What are you speaking about your job? What are you speaking about your spouse? What are you speaking about your children? What are you speaking about things that are happening in the world? What are you speaking about the political situation? What are you speaking about the financial situation? What are you speaking about the world? What are you speaking about whatever it is, no matter what, no matter what, you got it. Being in the trenches means you need to you need to address everything in your life. And maybe you're not a person that doesn't have your the complexities in your life are really not that uh, uh, expansive. But the little things that you can do, I mean, because you got to start with the little thing. Got to start with got to start with the little thing first. You know, got to start with the little thing first. And then when you kind of get a clear uh, perception of those negative things first, and then. Stop. The, the, I think I'm really the stop, 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 speaking those negative things and get the felt sense of experience of changing the direction by simply doing that. That is what you need to do. That is what you really need to do. It's what you really need to do. Is and when when you start when you start to get the feeling of taking control of your life in that particular way with the negative items and I don't care who you are everybody's got it everybody every everybody whatever you're thinking about the political situation whatever you're thinking about the financial situation whatever you're thinking about what's going on in the world and whatnot because you're just going to swirl in the toilet with all the ever things that are going out there too if you're thinking if you're attached to it and it's it's very difficult not to be attached to it but you know there's there's a spiritual thing going on there too and i would tend to think you probably learn more about that in church on sundays and yeah church on sundays and and there's there's definitely some purpose and some things that are going on as far as that is concerned but you know getting in being in the trenches and paying attention to your thought life and changing the direction with the things that you're speaking you know I mean, I beat myself up with the money bat so many times for years, for years, you know, because <coughs> because I was, you know, obviously attached to it. And then here I'm going through, a, you know, another transition in my life. And then, you know, I think something about this with money. And I was like, no, 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 wait. Uh -uh, I'm not going to torment myself anymore. I'm going to change the directions of the thought. I have an abundance of money. And, um... Changing the direction of, of just taking yourself away and going in the other direction away from the negative things. And you got to do it. You got to go through the felt. I, 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 I think I 100% I 100% think that that is what needs to be accomplished first. First and foremost, that you kind of, it's kind of like gaining control of your life in that particular area that you're in, paying attention to your thought life and what your narrative is and going along the precepts of that alone. And once you can accomplish that, and once you can start to, st I mean, literally, if you can just stop saying things and wait and go, whoa, no. You know, just like my little story about my Porsche, if you watch my other videos where I was driving and I, you know, I'm not going to repeat it again, but you know, I realized 
Uh, you know, the last guy, and I will never forget that, cut me off going under the viaduct, under 20th and Youngfield, and I will, oh, dang, and stopped. Time to stop, you know, for, so for you, with any of those things that you're in life, time to stop, stop. 